हॅलो अँड वेलकम बॅक टू माय चॅनल पांचीज मंडलान अँड टुडे इज दी थर्ड डे थर्ड डे ऑफ मेकिंग मंदाला सो लास्ट टाइम मी लर्न हाऊ टू मेक अ ग्रेड अँड टुडे वी आर गोईंग टू मेक ऑल दी पॅटर्न्स विच आय नो देर कॅन ऑल्सो बी सम पॅटर्न्स इन्क्लुडेड मोर बट नाव बेसिकली वी आर गोईंग टू लर्न बेसिक सिम्पल अँड येस बेसिक अँड सिम्पल मंदाला पॅटर्न्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट वी आर गोईंग टू नीड इज इज अ रूलर अँड दिस इज थर्टी सेंटीमीटर लॉंग नाव वी हॅव वॉट वी हॅव टू डू इज so what we have to do is place it at the length of the paper take some distance to mark and mark at each 1 cm vertical sorry i mean yes i mean uh, vertical lines because there is a specific paper for it which i am going to show you in third part of this video we needed that uh, such pages for harder patterns so now i have here marked all the lines same i am going to do at this side so now we have marked all the lines of 1 cm so now what we have to do is take a lead pencil don't forget i am taking a lead pencil as it is pointed and make perfect lines which we did, uh, did not get from a usual pencil now here we have all uh, lines we have marked 
so now as i said we need today your cd drive marker and the second thing which we need is a thing for making lines we need a big ruler as i said so why we need that the reason is as much big ruler we use our lines are perfect as we want when we use some rulers uh, which are smaller like 15 cm this is 15 cm scale or ruler it doesn't um uh, fit all the page so the line is not perfect sometimes um, it might be wrong direction or something like not perfect so that's why be careful and use a big ruler not this one that's why we need something uh, some big rulers so now in this video i am going to teach you or show you simple patterns in mandala which obviously you can make easily because they are too easy so let's get started the first mandala or something like pattern it's too simple what we have to do is just wait for a second drop bumpati touching the both lines and then draw one more bumpati inside this uh, uh, first one and color it this is very simple isn't it so now let's make other uh, means complete this whole pattern like this So now here we have completed our first pattern. So now let's move on to the second one. Second one is also simple. We just have to make some spirals. How to make it? It's really simple. Just make first upon circle, then continue it by taking some distance. Make round round. and finish this is a spiral and you can make such more don't forget we have to touch the spirals to each other so it just looks like a pattern so now we have finished your second pattern so now let's move on the third so third one is also easy it's nothing hard but for some people it might be hard we just have to make some shape like this 
which we obviously you make in in these designs we have to make it and again make another shape like this one inside it and color you can make such more so it looks like a pattern so now you have finished third now let's move on to the fourth one fourth is also something like easy so now the fourth one is also such simple what we have to do is just make bigger line and make a round over it then some medium some small however you want it make such shapes means lines it is too simple isn't it so now your yeah, our fourth pattern is also completed so now the fifth one is really really simple what we have to do is just make zigzag and now make some triangles inside the upper and down part triangles now your our fifth one is also completed but so now let's move on the next which is also simple make some bumpati and draw or make i inside it two i <clears throat> now next pattern is some hard for some people means it is easy but little harder for some people means uh, children or something like that so what we have to do is underline the upper and down line which we have marked with the ruler now draw lines or some cubes inside it and then make a such lines inside the cubes now draw a triangle inside the downside triangle means
and color it. Then the thing we uh, which we have to do at the upper side is draw lines. Now we are our seventh pattern is also completed. Let's move on to the eighth. Eighth one is really important, which we mostly make, and it is also simple. Make some bumper tees. Divide it into two parts each. Draw a line if you want at the downside. Then at this side, draw a dot. And now on the other side, color it. So your eighth pattern is completed. I just want to tell you uh, guys that if something, uh, someone who is in second or uh, third standard and or more than more lesser um, smaller than that and he or she is not able to draw such types of patterns or it is harder for them to understand my language which is now English uh, then don't worry just ask your elders and what about the patterns is make such patterns which are easier for you and uh, it is not compulsion that uh, suppose now this pattern is harder for you and you uh, you are not able to draw it then don't worry just leave it because draw it as your age limit if you are able to draw it or make it make it and if you are not able to make it just try it next time there's a thought on it try try but don't try follow that now the ninth pattern which we uh, which is also used in some mandalas and really easy is to draw lines four lines vertical and then what we have to do is attaching the last one we have to draw four lines attaching the last one draw four horizontal lines then again draw your vertical four lines again draw horizontal four lines now like this complete the pattern you can draw more than four as this is a one centimeter line so we can add more than four lines then it will look more um, perfect then let's move on to the tenth one which is also simple just like the spirals we have to draw your boxes cubes and then 
leaving some distance make something like this and draw a dot now continue this method So here we have also finished our 10th one pattern. Just want to tell that if your 10th pattern is not perfect as uh, we have to draw straight lines. Don't use a scale. It is just like this. My one is also something like not perfect or good as much as I want. But still. We are making it from our hand, not using any scale, so it uh, might be not perfect. So, leaving one line, we are going to make 11th one, which is also using some patterns. Just we have to make some shapes like this. We will make. Draw a line down side. Now what we have to do is divide it into half and now draw lines which looks like leaf. at the other side. Your art 11th one is also finished. Now let's move on to 12th pattern. So 12th one is uh, also little harder for smaller kids. Border the upper and downside lines. Then what we have to do is as we draw lines here we just have to draw it um, slanting for so now after making such uh, slanting lines we just have to make another way slanting lines and you also we will make four such lines. Continue this pattern till the end. Now here we have make four slanting and I don't know lines. So now what we have to do is draw some dots at the upper side and make some circles at the downside. Make smaller circles. By mistake I make bigger circles and color. the rest of thing so friends don't forget this is a giveaway video so don't forget to comment in the comment box and tell me your experience about how drawing these patterns. So now the 13th pattern is also easier. Not for everyone but easier. What we have to do is draw a line upper side may come down. Okay, this is a pattern. Follow this pattern. 
and now what we have to do is draw circles at the center in each half cube so this is also a pattern so now let's move on to the 14 this was really simple and this is also simple the thing which we have to do is just draw a circle small circle make a dot inside it just make a small line attaching another circle or again make a dot and follow this pattern So now the 15th pattern is here, 15th pattern, this is our last pattern which is easy and really easy. So what we have to do is just underline the upper line and the down line means border it and draw zigzag lines inside it make these lines or zigzag lines perfect now after this what we have to do is draw lines at this direction at the down triangle attaching the lines to the triangles now at the upper side it is blank so what we have to do is again draw line lines but at this direction it should be opposite draw as much lines as you want it doesn't matter but so now your our 15 patterns are completed i am going to make another video of uh, more patterns but more harder than this one don't forget to watch that video for today only this much and don't forget to send a giveaway means send a comment in the comment box and also don't forget to like this video Subscribe my channel and also click on the bell icon to get new notifications of my videos. So uh, you can also follow on mummy, sorry, follow me on Facebook. For today, only this much. Bye bye.